yourself. Scenario: This game is life and death for these teams. Not really death, but more, more, uh, more life. Yeah, that's for and, sure. It uh, looks like something's going on with the track bottom lane. Though. It looks like that man yeah, might go down. He's in a bit of trouble here. He's getting clicked down. Tried to salve, won't save him. And he's he's just being slowly clicked down by Slad. It's actually really sad. Yep, feeling that uh, Diabolic Dedic nerf. That's true, actually. It used to do some great damage at one, didn't it? So, yeah. Then you just soaked the whole thing. Back up in top. Matthew's in a bit of trouble here. Ryzen. Ryzen. Got. Okay, well, we got him. With the uh, last minute. Uh... So, this mid match this mid matchup, it should be. Um, it's pretty Lena what? favored, right? Shouldn't it be? Crap, I wasn't looking. Uh. Oh, all of Lena's spells uh, have way better cooldown in comparison to uh, Death Prophet Switch. Rift Swarm, 7 second cooldown, I mean, that's Ember's great. Gonna... Is he gonna die? Yeah, he's that's Back up in top, they're going from the dark, he's getting pretty close. Ah, well, Frank is gonna pay for it with his life either way, but uh, going down. You see that rotation of Oracle coming in, level 2 Purifying Flames is prepped and ready. Slow, so this is the only thing that Lena is like really bad at trying to deal with is that any rotation from any hero and she just can't. We're killing Madara up in the top, Rubik not actually claiming the last hit. And there's gonna be a salve going up by Frank. I love the chase animation now when a hero is low because that actually oh back down in bottom now. Platoon getting stunned out, he will be clicked on slowly and surely by Sladden. Fun fact of this game, he hasn't done anything yet in these first seven minutes. Yeah, the flesh also has no items, but uh, let's take a quick check up in top where we see Rising go down, but the double shackles will be there. Not gonna find too much else though. Matthew getting slowly burnt away by Madara. Slide of Fist will confirm the kill. Did they get it very badly to be useful? So there's three heroes in the mid, both teams. The Guna Blade goes out immediately out onto Rising with like literally no hesitation. Bobos is gonna. Oh, they find the double shackles. They bring in at least one Ember Spirit Remnant to confirm the kill, and Matthew being chased underneath the tower. He will be going down to the slow, insidious burn. And now, they're looking to get the jump out onto Frank here. They do have a shack. Well, they do have it, but there's no mana. Eight wand charges, and the war goes out of the Death Prophet. That ultimate's at half. They will manage to get the kill, actually, and now they're looking for Frank still? Stunned in the back lines, they will at least get the Ember out of there, and Sladden, no ultimate, no TP, no nothing. He's one dead with the Wyvern. That's a times three killing spree going down as well. Much as he can, and then now he's just dropping him down, and pretty sure this is one dead Winter Wyvern. Slowly getting clicked on by the boar, and actually dead to Prada. And then have the, uh, the Brewmaster eventually have a blink with that Radiance, which uh, now he's actually going for Midas instead. Now he's also roared up, and stunned up, and he's one dead boy! So, uh... Right, because you have a level 7 Lesh with Max Edict, and you have a, a Death Prophet with Exorcism, so your goal is to take towers. Oracle Ultimate stolen by the Rubik. That's actually really good for them, but, uh... I'm pretty sure, yeah, Ryzen's dead 100% there. And unfortunately, they have not really done that. The war goes out on the Winter Wyvern up in the top, and that is one dead Winter Wyvern again. He is uh, three and three so far. Back down in the bot, they are looking for a counter engagement. Oracle takes a Laguna Blade to the face. Now, oh, there's a lift out on the tower. It's getting pretty low. Benjez pops his blue, and uh, he is actually stunned up at the Oracle Ultimate, and he needs a blade to the face. And now we are going to see the clicks on onto Lena. Is it going to be enough? Yeah, there's enough damage on top of this tower to kill. Goes the same for the time being, and it looks like everyone's going down there. Dragon will be the first one. Frank following as well. Trying to find the stun onto Matthew. They do that as well, and maybe trying to find at least one return kill. They can't get it. Madara low, but not low enough. Though Atune, though, is back in. He carries all the auras. That explains why he's got, like, the siege thing. Is oh my god, Brada's HP is gone! No TP available for this one, but he is going to be lifted up. He's losing a lot of HP and barely gets out of that one. They do manage to steal Searing Chains, so... Not too bad, not too bad. Oh, I mean, obviously they lose the Leshrac, which has literally been doing nothing this whole game. As a position 4, obviously, it doesn't really matter. But still, the Rubik actually has more gold than he does. Uh, he's also good, so it doesn't matter. Whoa, Raslin getting the per the Raisin getting the perfect ultimate in the Winter Wyvern order to follow suit. Root, it's gonna be there. 
It's not taking any. He's dead. Just <laughs> taking any damage. Yeah. Which isn't. It's not awful. Yeah, he just picked up BKB. That's a big deal. Double silence down on the bot here, but the roar goes out immediately onto the Death Prophet. Also silence, now stunned. Getting hit with actually literally everything here, and now he's dead. And uh, yeah, I did, yeah, the Sven double damage with the ultimate as well as Mask of Madness going to work. That is a three shot kill out on Horizon. Now they're looking for the Ember. There is no remnant available either way, and eats an E plate. That was very unnecessary. Into the air, following with every stun in the game, and clicking all the stuff with all the spells. The tune drop, he gave up, he was just standing there. And there goes yeah, the he... so high ground, and he's out of there. Sven dropping ultimate, blinking in, he does have his BKB available and does exactly that, and Ryzen's immediately dead. They also find the kill on Slide, and they're looking for more. Yules out onto the Ember Spirit, no stun to follow suit. They find the kill on the Brew Panda Splits. Now they're looking for Robos as well. The Soul Siphon is going to be stolen, and that's one dead looking Madara. Now they're looking for back in mid. Robos getting pretty low, and he is dead. Five man wipe on G. Add this game in the bag. Frank clicked on. The defensive roar is going to go out there, but it's going to be lifted up into the air, as well as Ruby as well. As dead fish. There we go. A little while there. Product. Yeah, there, there was no escaping that one, friend.